2022, Mario Rios would begin his legendary journey on YouTube. He would be the man who would redefine athletics, aesthetics, and fitness all together. Beforehand, bodybuilders were the pinnacle of fitness and physical ability. They represent aesthetics, athletics, and just fitness in general. However, this one man has managed to change and piss off this entire community. Instead of worshipping Chris Bumstead, he instead chose Leon Edwards. Other than that, he actually did redefine aesthetics and athletics altogether. And how did he do this? By calling bodybuilders lazy. For all who don't know, Mario Rios is a fitness YouTuber who claims that bodybuilders are unathletic because they prioritize machines over compound movements. But is this really true? Is Mario Rios' claim on bodybuilders being lazy actually true? Or is he just a fraud with a fake degree in exercise BS? For this video, we'll be discussing is his claims on bodybuilders being unathletic true or not. So firstly, we need to define athletics and how to build athletics in the gym. So in order to build athletics in a gym, you got to strengthen the movements involved in the sport specifically. In general, for most if all sports, you must train multi-joint compound movements. Movements that typically train natural human movements require stability and replicate real life activities. For example, the barbell squat will actually replicate you squatting down in order to get the groceries. Movements such as squats, bench press, deadlift, pull-ups, dips, and so many more multi-joint compound movements that are freestanding, free weight, and require stability are great for athletics because they help strengthen the human body, strengthen the movement, and overall transfer the strength built in the gym, outside the gym, to that sport. The way weightlifting improves athleticism is that they just strengthen and boost these movements in the sports. Weightlifting is an extremely easy way in order to boost these movements, in order to strengthen the human body, in order to help you jump higher, push harder, and etc. This is why many top athletes include resistance training programs, plyometric work, and etc. in their sports, in season and mainly off season. So number two is why are bodybuilders lazy? Mario's claims that bodybuilders are unathletic is because they prioritize machines over free weights. See, machines are the opposite of free weights. Yes, they might include multiple muscle groups at once. However, they remove the stability demand of an exercise completely. A Smith machine squat is so much more stable than a regular barbell squat. This is great for building muscle as it lets you isolate the selected muscle group more to get more to muscular failure and therefore more muscle growth. However, this is where athletics takes over hypertrophy. It's because in order to train athletics, you must train in natural human movements and movements found in your sport. And all of these movements require one thing, stability, which is what machines and other movements such as the chest press, these movements don't have that stability compound. They don't have the stability aspect of natural human movements. This is why many bodybuilders can't transfer their strength over to regular movements. For example, the lat pull down will never transfer its strength over to pull ups. Now, obviously, this is not applied to every single bodybuilder. Arnold Schwarzenegger, for example, emphasizes the importance of basic movements. The important thing is that you train the proper way, which is to train the basics. That if it is the squats, if the two arm curl, if it's the bend over rowing, if it's the clean and the press, the bench press, the incline press, the dumbbell press, all of those basic exercises. They're all athletic movements that require stability and overall natural strength. However, with this new era of bodybuilding, it's becoming more and more common machines to be used, equipment to be used, all in the form of adding stability. So the final conclusion, are bodybuilders truly lazy? There are three questions that must be asked here. Are bodybuilders lazy? Do machines make you lazy? And is Mario Reels actually correct? So are bodybuilders lazy? Well, yes and no. See, bodybuilders are not lazy in terms of they do train hard, they do diet correctly. Being a bodybuilder is still hard work. However, the way they do train, it is kind of lazy. You know, they can be picking the barbell squat over the Smith machine squat. However, they choose not to in the form of hypertrophy. Now back to the point, do machines make you lazy? Well, I'd say no. Why? If you're prioritizing a compound movement that is considered athletic and you're using isolation movements and machines in order to strengthen the individual muscle groups involved in that compound movement. For example, you include chest flies in order to improve your bench press. That's not lazy. You're using isolation movements 
to improve and boost your compound movement. The only problem is that bodybuilders will prioritize the isolation movement, not the compound movement. So their muscles don't know how to work together. I think a muscle group is one thing, but not teaching your muscle groups how to work together is really falling short. Now, third and final question, is Mario Rios correct? Are bodybuilders lazy? and are his claims in his shorts correct? Actually, the information in most of his shorts are actually pretty accurate. His claims on bodybuilders being lazy is just a way to piss them off. But most of the information provided in his shorts, and especially his long videos, if you haven't watched them, are pretty accurate. And actually, he knows what he's doing, so props to him. He just makes himself seem like the villain so he gets more views and potentially pisses off bodybuilders. So if you want to watch more videos like this and you want me to worship Leon Edwards just like he does, please subscribe and try to hit 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. And also check out Mario Reels. Without his channel, this video would not exist. So yeah, subscribe. Okay, bye-bye.